Hi and welcome back to the farm and the series of Road to a Billion. As you can see, I am picking up some uh, some eggs here because it is November and we are going to sell them at the farmer's market. Yeah, that's right. I think we're going to get around 14k for them, if I remember correctly. But yeah, other than that, we haven't been doing that much on the farm. I've been doing some fertilizing contracts. Uh, offline here so I haven't recorded that but you can see we're up to 170,000 so that's gonna be with these eggs if it's around 14,000 we're gonna be around 16,000 short of the short-term goal to get up to $200,000 but that we surely are going to do because we have a lot to sell on the farm so Let's just sell this and uh, let's see what we can do. Because to be frank, I think it's going to be selling the eggs now in November and then just going straight to January. And I'm going to show you why after we sell the eggs. Man, I love this trailer that we bought. I think we're just going to buy another one when we have the cash for it. <laughs> or if we can buy a bigger one, that would be awesome. Let's uh, drop these off here. Okay, yeah, 14,125. Sure, okay. <laughs> All right, so we are up to 184,000. Great. Let me show you what I was talking about. So looking at this, I mean, we do have the sorghum here in January. 52,000 of value, but we're going to keep that for the chickens for now at least. But then look at this, like we have 54,000 in silage. Uh, we have grass that is going to become silage, which is going to be, I think it's going to be 40,000. Because, yeah, if you remember, we kind of just multiplied the grass value with four, and that was the, the silage value. And that's going to be sold in January as well. So potentially we could have around 150,000 if we sell the sorghum. But I don't think we're going to do that. But we are for sure going to have like 95,000 worth of silage. I mean, oh my God, that's amazing. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, holding up traffic here because we need to evaluate our income. <laughs> But yeah, it is looking good. Ah, uh, look, the sun, the sun is shining upon our business adventures. Ah, uh, the hope, the hope for the farm here on Elm Creek. I can almost taste the billion dollars. <laughs> I mean, wow, look at this. This is all of our own silage here. Yeah, wow, this is a lot of silage. And grass, I think. Wait, let, let's check this. Yeah, that's fermenting 95%. Yeah, oh my god, this is gonna be turned into silage really soon. And then over here, we have the silage that we kind of stole. <laughs> yeah, that is that has become silage. Okay, great. Nice. Yeah, we uh we kind of stole that <laughs> from field 71. <laughs> We got wool going here. Yeah, looking good, sheeps. Looking good. We are going to expand this. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that when we hit 200k. Yeah, very good. But you know, the chickens, I'm, I'm unsure what to do about the chickens. Because we're selling, yeah, about 14, 15,000 a year, as you just saw. And if we buy one of the bigger chicken pastures. That is three times more chickens, and that means three times more of the income. So that would be 45,000 a, a year, which is good. Uh, that's really good. But I don't know, I'm a little bit um, sick of chickens <laughs> because it's just sorghum feed and nothing happens. With, uh, with the sheep, you can at least have a uh, a bigger kind of picture you can have the wool you can turn that into fabric and you can turn that into clothes 
I mean, obviously, yeah, we can turn the eggs into cakes and stuff like that, but I feel that production line is so much longer, and I think that's just a little bit more endgame than fabric and cloth. Clothes, I mean. <laughs> but yeah, we'll, we'll see what we are going to do, but this place here definitely will be where we have the sheep. I'm going to move the sheep from over there because as much as I like it having the sheep in kind of a hilly part of the of the farm I mean this looks really nice it looks good they have like shade here coming in from the trees coming in from that big tree but driving here and picking this up it's not ideal and because you just have to drive through these bushes and yeah, I don't really like that it looks nice but it's not really practical so yeah we're gonna have to move it over there by the chickens and also yeah looking at the the silage base we're going to have to do something about those look at that that's a lot of silage <laughs> we're gonna have to invest in some kind of silage uh, bale um, shed or something or the other yeah we'll see Actually, I have been looking at this. So I've, I've used this before uh, when I've been playing with some friends. And uh, this is really nice. It kind of bugged a little bit when we were playing, but we had a lot of mods. So <laughs> I'm not sure if that contributed to that. But this is basically, it can store everything. Everything, I think, except bales. So you throw this in here and this can distribute those products to production lines that you have so i kind of like that actually but we'll see it is 50k it's not that much um but i think this is going to help us a lot by just kind of streamlining the production processes we'll see i got this as a as an option and then with that i think we would also get something like this the bale and pallet storage which just holds bales and pallets i think that's yeah, it, it's not looking super nice, it's a little bit rusted and stuff, but I think we're going to have to live with it because we can get the silage bales just off from the from the farm. And this is not a mod, this is in the base game, I think, or yeah, it doesn't say premium expansion or anything. So yeah, it's 30,000, yeah, 29,000, so all in all, like... Um, 79,000 for this and uh, the storage mod, the logistics center. I think that's pretty good, actually. For future ease of use, basically. But yeah, that's it for November, I think. I don't think we have a lot of other stuff to do here. Let's just wait out the winter, basically. Yeah, let's go to bed. And I'll see you probably in the springtime, if nothing really major happens. Okay, snowy January. You know what? Let's, uh... Oh, it's happening here. <laughs> that's, that's weird. So this is exactly where the, uh... Where the shed stood. Okay, that's, uh... A neat bug. <laughs> Either way, let's get these, uh... Pallets. No, not pallets. Bales! Let's get these bales sold. 93,900. Oh, it's actually value 94,600. Okay, cool. 495,000 liters of silage. Where do you want it? Animal dealer. That's far away, but sure. That's more than the biogas plant. Fine. Let's, uh, let's go with animal dealer. Cool, cool, cool. So, this is going to take a little while, I would guess. Imagine being two people and having two tractors now. That would be nice. Oh, maybe... Yeah. That's... Uh, I haven't really mentioned that. Well, yeah, maybe I have. But we... Uh, the Discord server is starting to grow a little bit. And I am planning to have like a server running in the future. I just need to set it up. Or actually, well, not set it up. I just need to plan for it. <laughs> and then set it up. I'm not sure what it's going to look like. But, yeah, I think that would be a fun thing. So if you think that sounds interesting and fun, you can join the Discord server. It's uh, We got a link in the description. 
Yeah, just join, say hi, we're still a small server, but the more the merrier, and uh, when we get enough people in there, I think, yeah, let's just uh, start up a community server and do some fun stuff. I actually have no idea how servers like that work in, in Farming Sim, because I've only ever played with friends who just hosted the game as we are playing, so... Yeah, we uh, we haven't had a server like that, so yeah, that's gonna be interesting to say. But yeah, join the Discord server if you want. There's a bunch of cool people in there advising me how to play better and uh, coming with really fun tips and tricks on what to do. I really appreciate that and I, I think that's really fun. Let's drop this off. Bam. Oh yeah, 15,000 per trailer. I think that's what it was before, because yeah, it's a little bit over a thousand dollars per bait. That's awesome. But yeah, let me just do this over and over and over again. <laughs> and uh, I'll be right back. Oh, but wait. Yeah, see, we're up at one hundred and ninety eight thousand dollars. That's two thousand away from the short term goal. All right. So, I'll be back when we break that. That's gonna be in the next trailer we, we sell. Okay, second trailer here. Nice! 213,000! Oh wait, we got less for that. Wait a minute. Okay, wait, but first let's celebrate the 213,000. Woohoo! Short term go! Yay! <laughs> But what's happening here? 191, it's the same price. That's so weird. Why, why was it less? Okay, I don't know. Well, that was weird. But yeah, we got 60,000 left here to sell. Oh my God, we're gonna have so much money. Oh my God. I think this episode is gonna be awesome because now we're, we can do some stuff. Oh yeah. Okay, this is the last trailer. If you remember, this pile here is the uh, <laughs> the silage that we stole <laughs> from field 71. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, that was an experiment, and um, it was fun. But I don't think we're gonna do that again. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> but either way, yeah, this is the last one. And as you can see, we're up to 265,000, so we're gonna land at around 280,000 with this, which feels really, really good. But yeah, let's uh, just sell this and see what the total is. Oh yeah, it feels like we have been here before. <laughs> we actually did the same drive in a, an episode where we sold a lot of bales as well. Okay, here we go. Last one. Oh yeah, 279,000, almost 280,000. That's awesome. All right, everything is gone here. Let's just park this up here. Great. No silage at all. We only got some hay. Yeah, we still have the sorghum here. I am tempted to sell a little bit of that, but you know what? Let's let's check here first. Yeah, 96,000. Oh my god. That is we that is the record. We have never sold anything for that much. Wow. And then on top of that we sold uh in the previous episode we did sell a lot of bales from the kind of <laughs> sketchy criminal stuff we did with Field 71. So we do have more from that. I think that was in yeah, in, in the summertime, so we can't really see that here, but that was a lot as well. I think that was like maybe thirty thousand something. Yeah. But either way, let's repay here. I think we have repaid uh, 20,000. So yeah, let's just repay. Yeah, that's 20,000. That's 10% more that we have repaid. Yeah, let's keep it at that because we can sell some of this. The sorghum here, we got 86,000 liters of sorghum. And these chickens here, they... Um, they eat around, yeah, rounded up, they eat for about 8,000. And the chicken coop, the, or the bigger pasture that I'm looking at, is three times the chicken, so three times the feed. So that's gonna be 
uh, 24,000 a year to feed these. 24,000 liters of, of sorghum or grain or whatever. And yeah, we got more than enough. We got three years worth of food. So I think we can sell, comfortably sell, let's sell half of this. Like 40,000. That's not even half. Let's sell 40,000 liters here. That's going to be, yeah, 25,000 ish, somewhere around that. That that's going to even out the repayment to the loan. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I know. I said I was going to hold off on selling the sorghum a little bit, but <laughs> I mean, we we got 260,000. We were up to 280. If we can sell just a little bit more so we can almost reach the 300,000. I mean, we're going to be sitting pretty comfortably when we come up to those amounts or actually we are sitting comfortably here but we do have some uh, options when it comes to purchasing the next kind of equipment and stuff like that because we are going to to do the sheep and and chickens i think this month or maybe not this month maybe not in january per se but this episode yeah where is that dang train hello All right, here it comes. Nice. Great. Is it coming from this way? Yeah, it's backing in again. <laughs> All right. Let's back this up here and fill it with sorghum. Something like that. Okay, that's 31,000 liters. It means we have 33,000 worth there now. There we go, 40,000 liters. All right, yeah, let's sell this. Yes, 25,000, oh yeah, awesome. Okay, we are up to 280,000, nice. And we haven't checked the store, ah, oh, what a disappointment. Look at this. We haven't had this much money ever. And this is what is up on the store. Oh, well, can't have it all. Yeah, I think it's just a matter of uh, planning out this kind of space here. Yeah, maybe do this in February, I guess. Yep, let's get to bed. Okay, it's February here and uh, I started to clean up a little bit on the farm. Well, not clean up, but, you know, just moving stuff around so we can start planning what we actually want to do with the space here. I think we are going to have to sell the chickens. Yeah, because there there is no chicken transport. So we're just going to sell everything uh, with the chickens, basically. Everything that is pertaining to chickens. Um, I guess, yeah, we are... Yeah, we're going to have to put the pallets away somewhere. Again, something like a logistics center here would be really awesome. We'll see what we can do there. But I don't think it's necessary for now. It's more of a future proofing thing for when we do have a lot of uh, stuff going on. Let's hop into this tractor and yeah, let's just pick up everything here with this. We're going to have to pick up the the eggs as well, even though they're not finished, but <laughs> that's, I don't think that's going to be a problem. It's going to look a little bit wonky here on our trailer, but it is what it is. And we can just dump this off. Oh, well, that was weird. We can just dump this off uh, on wherever we want it, basically. And then we can sort it how much ever we want. But for now, yeah, we are going to need to do this. <laughs> Why is the pallets going all weird? Look at that. Okay. There we go. That's much better. It doesn't really matter where we put it. There we go. Sell that for 2,348. Wow, we had it for 70 months. Wow. Yeah, we had it for a long time. Uh, Wait, rename it back? Huh? Can't I sell it? Do I have to demolish it? No. I wanna sell it! Can I sell this? What? Huh? 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, maybe I need to actually go into here. Here we go. So we got chickens. 30 chickens. Yeah, sell for 600. Yes. Okay, and now, yeah, now we can sell. All right. So that's, yeah, that's 3,000 per pasture, including chickens. Okay, let me go around and sell these chickens. Oh, we are almost up to 300,000. <laughs> All right, great. Yeah, this looks uh, barren. Okay, cool. So let's plan this. What do we want here? I think something maybe like this. I think that would be awesome, maybe. Yeah, something like this. Yeah, right, because then you can... We can kind of move that row there in the back. Ooh, we actually have a lot of place now for bales. That is awesome. Wow, that's really nice. Okay, cool. I like that. But yeah, 97,000. Wow, we do have, we, we can afford to buy two of these. <laughs> That'd be cool. That would be really cool. But yeah, let's not do that just yet. Um, but yeah, I think this is a pretty good placement. 65 sheep here. Wait, let me check. Because, yeah, this would be better here, I think. Because that's where the pallets are coming out. Or maybe it doesn't really matter. Let's check with the chickens. Okay, oh yeah, and the pallets come out there. But yeah, no, maybe... Maybe we do want the chickens here. Because then we can drive here in the middle, because the pallets are coming out there on the left side. And we can feed them there on the end. Yeah, I think that's actually a good idea. So we have the chickens here, and then the sheep over there. Right? Yeah. I think that's nice. I think that's fine. And we have a lot of space back there with pallets. Ooh, I really like that. Something, yeah, around here maybe? There? Okay, let's buy this. Oh yeah, chickens. We got the chickens. The sheep now. Okay, we don't want to overlap. We want them around here then, I guess. Yeah. Ooh, it's actually a little bit tight. Oh well. Um, yeah, it is what it is. We're gonna have to go with it. Maybe we wanna do like this. Yeah, something like that. Okay. Sheep. And chickens. Let me do some landscaping here. Yeah, I, I really like this. A little bit of a, a turn here also. Yeah, we can actually have a little bit of a, a green grass here. I think that looks pretty good. And around here. Yeah, I think this looks good. Let's fix this up as well. So it's actually grass over here. I know grass is kind of expensive to do like this. <laughs> can't really have like two blobs of whatever grass back here. It needs to be nice. There we go. Actually, we should, mm, yeah, we should make like a road through here because we are going to probably, maybe we should do that. Well, you know, for now, that was like 5,000 that grass. So <laughs> it's not, <laughs> yeah, no, this is fine. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at this. New and improved. Yeah. And I like that these two are kind of in line with each other. Well, yeah, kind of. Not perfect. It is a little bit tight here. With, uh, with the pallets coming out. But yeah, we are probably only going to drive here when we need to pick up. Oh, no. Who am I kidding? We're going to drive here all the time. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should put gravel here as well. This will make it look a little bit nicer. I wonder if we actually... Hmm, do we put the trailer with the sorghum over here? You know what? It just occurred to me that I did not save before I did this. <laughs> so, yeah, we, we're, we're just going with this. This is what we're doing right now. <laughs> but let me see where this trailer fits. Let's see, I'm wondering, like, can we just have it? Oh, maybe we can't. Let me select the tip side here. Yeah, tip side back. And then we can 
sneak this in here. This would yeah, great, nice. Okay, cool, great. So we can just have this here. Oh, we just need to we just need to hook it up to the tractor and just unload. Yeah. Oh my god, that's gonna be so nice to feed the chickens. And then this trailer, we can just, I don't know, maybe, maybe just hide back there or something. I don't know. We only need this for harvesting purposes right now. Yeah, you know what? Let's, uh, let's just put this here behind the sheep pen. I think that's going to be perfect for now. There we go. Great. Okay. And yeah, let's start getting the sheep over because I could sell all the sheep. Let's check it out. So I could sell them for a thousand dollars, which is 25,000 because yeah, we got 25 of them. And then I buy new for, yeah, I could buy the young ones here, the lambs, I guess, or yeah, they they are said to be sheep here, but yeah, I could just buy those for 200. I mean, that would be, Hmm. You know what? Maybe we should just do that. Because that's like eight, yeah, that's eight hundred dollars plus. Yeah, you know what? Let's just sell them, and then we can buy new in the new one. Oh yeah, because we're gonna have to buy new at least, anyhow. And I know you get more, yeah, you, you get more when you sell them with like a trailer and stuff. But we don't have that, and it costs a lot of money to rent it. So yeah, I opted out not doing that. Okay, the sheep, sheepies are gone. Bye bye. And uh, I'm just going to move this. Oh, wait, we need yeah, we need to pick that up as well. There we go. Let's just move this and so we can sell that. I wonder how much we can sell it for. Not that much, right? Oh, wow, we can sell it for 21,000. Oh, almost 22,000. Yeah, wow. Wow. Ooh, and we had uh, some <laughs> wool over there. <laughs> I'm glad that didn't disappear. <laughs> All right, cool. We got wool. Let's get some sheep in here. No, wait, wait, wait. Before we do that, let's put some some food there so they have something to eat when we actually get the sheep in there. Oh my god, this is amazing. I love this. This is so fun. All right, let's pick this up. Okay, yeah, we can only do two bales here, but whatever <laughs> yeah there we go oh wow okay we need more bales do we just put in everything there i guess maybe <laughs> well we got five bales left if we really really need to we can uh, we can uh, buy some but ideally we would only want this to be coming from our own fields but yeah we got the option and uh i'm not that fussed about it but yeah they have eleven thousand five hundred. you know what while we're at it let's uh fill up the chickens as well man i really like this setup yeah i'm just backing in here hooking up loading some sorghum here we're going to yeah i think we're we're going to have to get some uh, some more sorghum oh wow yeah that was yeah that just took it all okay let's uh well they have some food for now before we buy them or yeah when, when we buy them and they get in here we got some food in there for them let's do that what's the difference here if we buy yeah 360 i mean wow that's actually a lot of money this animal has reached its breeding age. Animals that are healthy and older than six months can reproduce. Okay. You know what? Um, let's just buy... Wait, roosters, they liven up your chicken coop. <laughs> That's what they do? <laughs> okay. Let's get... Uh, not, not 59. Let's get one rooster. There you go. We got one rooster. We didn't have a rooster before. I guess you're gonna need a rooster if you if you want to reproduce here. Um, and let's buy sixty and buy sixty. This is taking a while. Okay, we bought a lot of chickens. We got three hundred and sixty chickens in here. Oh, nice! Awesome. 
Yearly food, 21,600. Well, it's actually less than I thought. Cool. I wonder actually what the rooster does. I guess you need a rooster to actually make the chicken reproduce. But these are small chickens, so they're not reached puberty yet. So they can't reproduce just yet. But soon you are. And we're going to have so many chickens. Oh, no, wait. I bought the full pen with chickens. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh, I should have just bought like half or something. Oh, God. I'm stupid. Wait, can we, can we just sell them? It wasn't a lot, but... Yeah, no, we can't sell them. Dang it. Okay. We need to think before we do stuff. Or I need to think before I do stuff. <laughs> Let's buy some sheep. Yeah, I like the the white ones, but I think yeah, no, we're not gonna buy the adults. Let's buy let's buy all of these as as lambs here. Yeah, thirteen thousand and eleven hundred. Nice. Wow. Oh wow, we got a lot of sheep. Look at this. Wow. Hey guys, welcome home. Oh, that's nice. And these are going to take ooh, 30,000. That's a lot. And what did we have? Okay, we have 30,000 here. Okay, yeah, six and a half thousand. Okay, so this is like, yeah, almost 20,000 over here. Great. And then we have two over there. And um, yeah, so we got, we got enough. We got enough. We're not going to be in a hurry to buy any hay or grass. Yeah. We can get the grass and hay on our own. Nice. Okay, cool. Upgrades. Look at this. Yeah. I like this. Nice. And you know what? Let's just move this. Yeah, I don't know. Let's just put this here, actually. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, something like this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, we can just have that there for now. We can have this as an actual, like, loading and unloading area for now. Yeah, let's put this away. I'm thinking... Yeah, we, let's just put this here also. For now, this is gonna get a little bit too crowded, but... Yeah. For now, let's just put this here. Great. But yeah, just... Let me drive around here and see how this feels. Yeah, I mean, this is nice. A little bit tight there between the, the pallets. But yeah, I think this is nice. You can go in here, take a little bit of shortcut. It is tight, but it's not that tight. I think it's going to be fun. Hopefully. Great. Ooh, okay, we can actually move these as well. Let's do that real quick. Oh my god, I'm clumsy. Okay. All right, where do we put these then? Yeah, I'm guessing just around here. I don't want to put them like in this grass field. Like, yeah, I don't know. I don't want them to be in the way. This is admittedly a little bit in the way, but at least it's not a lot in the way. And we can kind of easily pick them up, but yeah. All right, great. That's that. Wow, we still have 143,000. Oh my god. Okay, let's check the sale. Man, come on. A cultivator that you need 500 horsepower for? Come on. Well, yeah, I guess we just wait that out. Do we want to do anything more here? I don't think so. We need to think about what we can do here, actually. And you know what? Speaking of that, we could do this over here. Yeah, I think that would be actually pretty nice. Easy to pick up and and load. Yeah, I think that would be nice. And then this over here. No, I don't like that. Maybe this over here. No. Ooh, actually. Ooh. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe over here? Huh. Or like this no but ooh, maybe like this so we cut off the road on the right oh yeah i kind of like this 
Or do I like this better? I think I like this better. Yeah, something like this. Because then we can come straight down from there and just unload. Wow, yeah. That would be cool. But yeah, let's not do this just yet. I think I think we can do this another time. We have a lot of money, but we don't have that much money. Yeah. But coming in here and having it on this side. Yeah. I mean, that would be kind of cool. And just having a road going here. And then just maybe... I like the grass over here, but... Yeah. Just maybe take away all of this grass. Yeah, maybe. We'll see. You know what? Let's get some sorghum. We need some sorghum for the chicken, so... Let's go fill this up. 46,000. Yeah. Nice. Okay, cool. That is 18,500. Let's get back to the farm and fill this up. See how much we can actually fit into the chicken pasture. Oh, you can actually feel that it's super slippery. <laughs> you gotta small tractor hauling some heavy cargo and yeah wow it's super slippery whoop what see i'm barely steering here wow that's pretty fun actually whoa oh see oh my god <laughs> oh careful oh god oh god okay it maybe does not look like much but like when you're driving well it feels a lot like it's actually like you're on on ice. That's cool. Okay, let's uh, park this up. I really like this spot. I really like this to be able to just get in here. Oh, maybe that was, oops. It's a little bit too tight. Oh no, are we stuck here? No, 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 no. Oh no, come on. Oh no, okay. There we go. Okay, almost, almost. Oh yeah, okay, we're up. Okay, let me just back this in real smooth like. There we go. Ooh, perfect. Ooh, perfect. Nope. Not perfect. <laughs> we need it a little bit more to the left. No, to the right. Here we go. This is perfect. Okay. Let's load this over. I'm kind of pushing. <laughs> Is it full? Yeah, okay, cool. 9,000 liters here. Yearly food, 21,000. Oh my god, wait, they... Wait. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, that's yearly. Oh, sorry, I thought... Oh, <laughs> I was like, they eat 21,000 in a month, but we only have 9,000, so you need to refill every month, like, multiple times, but not yet. Sorry, I read it wrong. Yearly food, 21,000. So we need to fill this up a bit over two times a year. I like that. Because with the other chickens, you had to fill up like four different pastures. Like every two to three months. Like, yeah, sure, you could wait them out and, f and fill them maybe two times a year or something like that. That just did not be right. But this is nice. Okay, so two to three times a year. Nice. Oh yeah, we got the rooster. Nice. Cool, great. Yeah, we did some nice stuff here on the farm. We didn't do a lot. It just did not feel like we have worked a lot. <laughs> but a lot of stuff has happened. We we did the short-term goal. Yeah, we uh, we were able to get that done. 200,000. We almost went up to 300,000. Yeah, I really like that. But yeah. Guys, I think that is going to be it for this episode. We only spent a couple of months here. Amazing. And we have done some awesome stuff with the sheep and the chickens. Yeah, this is going to move along really nicely now. I think I'm going to try to save up on the wool a little bit so we can go into the fabric uh, business, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Just a thought, maybe. We're talking in the Discord about what's best, and I think sheep and wool and fabric and clothes has been a, a thing that we've talked about a lot and i think that's a really good thing going forward we'll see but yeah 
thanks so much for watching. Thanks for following along this road to a billion. And uh, if you like this, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. There's going to be a lot more coming. And uh, see you in the next video. Bye.